Uh, this is Andrea Praver with Great Expectations Realty, and I am here with our newest addition, which is Madison Flick. Uh, she has joined the mayhem. Um, yes. Uh, <laughs> so welcome. Thank you. Uh, so you should be seeing some videos from Madison pretty soon, which is kind of exciting. Uh, not only is she a um, administrative assistant here with us right now, and she's kind of learning the ropes, she is actually doing a class right now to become a real estate agent. So. Wow, she's really trying to join the mayhem. Yes. <laughs> so why did you decide that you want to be a real estate agent? I felt like with my personality and how I like to kind of make my own schedule, do stuff like that, I think it would be a really good fit for me. I also know a lot of people that are in the business, really, and they love it. So, <laughs> Yeah, it was kind of funny because um, many of you know our agent, Josie um, Abbott. She actually does some videos as well. And um, she actually knows Madison really well. But when I put an ad uh, for looking for an administrative assistant part time, uh, I didn't put what brokerage it was or that it, you know much of anything. It was just a real estate office, and one of the first person that just applied like that was Madison, <laughs> and she really stood out. It was really great. And then come to find out, we kind of already knew her. <laughs> yes, so oh, that was, was funny. <laughs> Kind of weird. I was like, did you know, did somebody let you know that it was us and you no. had no idea? So it really just kind of, wow, it was weird how it worked out, but it's really been great. She's quick as a whip. I mean, Thank she's just <laughs> really getting stuff really, really quickly. So just kind of absorbing everything through osmosis or something. I don't know. That's kind of crazy. <laughs> so how are you finding it so far? Was it about what you thought, the whole real estate thing? Yes, a lot of what I thought. There's also a lot of just random stuff, but it's fun. It keeps it interesting. Have I kept my promise so far? Yes, yes, okay. you have. <laughs> Every day is different. I promised her. She said she was um, kind of bored with, uh, she's working at the county office, and she said it was yes. just, you know, the same thing over and over. And I said, I absolutely promise you, <laughs> you will never be bored. <laughs> it's That's a lot true. of fun. Yeah. There's always something different going on. Mm -hmm. There's always somebody different coming into the, the office. Um, crazy stuff. And you haven't even seen half of it yet. I'm it's sure. just mayhem. Absolute mayhem. So we're having a lot of fun. I think we have mm -hmm. a lot of fun in the office. And uh, it'll be even more fun when you're actually, actually you know, showing houses and doing the open houses and stuff like yeah. that. So we're really looking forward to that. So I think probably by next month you've finished yes. the class portion of it. Now she's gearing up to take the test. Sorry. I'm not going to lie. That's a horrible test. Oh, <laughs> really, goodness. For somebody that's taken that one, taken the broker's exam, gone through GRI, I can absolutely promise you it is, um, it's a very odd test, but we're going to help you out as much as possible <sighs> to struggle through that. We've all gone through it. Um, that little Quizlet thing, that seems to help a little bit. So yes. getting through the test, it's a whole bunch of questions that... Um, you know, definitions and stuff like that. So that helps. If any of you guys are out there taking the Florida real estate exam, Quizlet. <laughs> Quizlet.com is phenomenal. It does kind of help you. It's like flashcards and little games and mm -hmm. stuff like that. And it's totally free because it's other students that are going through the same thing. They basically don't do those as flashcards as uh, opposed to writing them out. Um, Lindsay, I actually, actually do did. both. I right. do the flashcards <laughs> off of Quizlet. <laughs> it helps to write it out, you know, yes. even if you're typing or just scribbling it down, it kind of cements Definitely. it. So, so how are you feeling about taking the test? Just kind of. I'm feeling okay. I'm extremely yes. nervous, but I think that yeah. for the most part, with yeah. a, about a week more of studying, I'll be okay. You'll be all set and you're ready to. Yes. Yeah. So normally what we recommend uh, when you're taking the test is also to do the cram course. Yes. You were able I'm to find this. some cram courses going, okay. So the weekend cram course, especially if you've done the online class, which you did do the mm -hmm. online class as opposed to the classroom. So it's basically um, the difference, I think, is when you're doing the classroom, you get the life experience and the stories that make it make you understand why the laws are there and why we're doing things a certain way. Whereas when you're doing the online course, it's just memorizing a whole yes. bunch of stuff that doesn't make any sense. So it's much, Pretty much harder. <laughs> so, but you can make it through because that cram course is, you know, instructor led and they really- I'm definitely kind of, doing that. Yeah, pound that into your head. <laughs> but yeah, take the cram course and then the following Monday or Tuesday, because it's normally a weekend thing, um, take the exam and you should be 
good to go. And if you're not, that's okay. You can take it as many times as you want within a one year and you just pay 25 bucks, I think, every time. Oh, I didn't. That makes me feel yes, better. it's not do or die. And I will tell you that at least a few people in our office have had to take it more than once. So do not get upset. It is totally great. That was not Lindsay, by the way. Lindsay, oh, yes. we knew she was. I think it. <laughs> She was so nervous about it. She's like, I just don't want to, you know, let anybody down. And yeah. Oh, flew right through. In fact, the teacher was asking her. She took the classroom. The teacher was asking her to help the other students. Oh, wow. <laughs> so we had no, no doubt that Lindsay would just plow right through that thing like it was nothing. She actually, uh, I think she actually enjoyed the experience. I'm not sure. <laughs> so. She said she was extremely nervous, but once she got through it she was like it was a lot more hype than i don't know I, think it might, I don't know about that. she said because she studied and did all the flashcards and all the notes and she, she was, was like, as prepared as possible yes that's what she was good at studying um i personally um i didn't think it would be i'm very good at taking tests and stuff so i really didn't think it was going to um, be as bad as it was and um i was thinking a hundred multiple choice questions how hard can it be? And you got like three hours to do it or something. Um, so I took like two and a half hours to do it. And um, wow. when I got outside, I was actually shaking more than I about threw up in the parking lot. That would have been <laughs> crying. Regardless, yeah. pass or fail, I'm going to just <laughs> saw him. So, um, but you know what? Every single time you'll just, you'll remember it. You'll have your own story <sighs> to tell the next agents coming yes. in. It'll be awesome. And then you get to actually do our training. I'm excited. And uh, we use the Josh Smith um, training. He is just phenomenal. I went through his program. It is amazing. So you've kind of gotten some access to it, but definitely not get into it right mm -hmm. now because you really got to get through that test and that's definitely the learning but, on that. but yeah it's it, we're having a lot of fun with Madison here <laughs> and uh it's only been what two weeks you've mm -hmm. been in here but yeah she's really found her her spot in her area so um and we're having a lot of fun so and definitely never boring no <laughs> never boring <laughs> So, well, welcome to Great Expectations. Thank you. And uh, we will see you guys tomorrow.